Hey, what's up everybody? So, I got a surprise tonight. Uh, my buddy Chris from Texas Racing Channel, you saw the, uh, the racing video we did with him versus my CTS. He gave me a shout and said, hey, I have my video guy back out. I can't, uh, I can't go out to Texas 2K by myself. I need you to come with me. So I was like, hey, let me check my work schedule. I've cleared a couple appointments, got it worked out. So uh, we're on a surprise trip right now. We're actually taking his flat out, which I mean, you guys have seen it, but I didn't want to bring my car out. Too much hassle, too much gas. It's like a four, four and a half hour drive. And uh, it, it's so much easier just to do it in this car. But, oh yeah, you remember this guy. Um, I think it's gonna cost us like 20 or 30 bucks for trip. Yeah, so <laughs> it's, it's so much easier. And plus, I mean, having a thousand horsepower, a thousand fifty, whatever they come with, versus everybody on the, out on the highway. We're not doing any actual racing at the track. Um, we don't do street racing either. But uh, we're mainly out there just doing media stuff and uh, just well, trying to get content. Yeah, uh, I'm there just to help him as much as I can. You know, maybe film a little bit of stuff for our for our channel as well. But uh, I'm just kind of vlogging as we go. So I'm going to film as many races as I can. Uh, so we should be able to be right there on the, the track itself, the media, the, the, the little yeah. wall. Yeah, we have media passes. Yeah, we have well, media passes. Yeah. But um, it should be a good time. It's we're going to be out here until Sunday. That's what Wednesday now. Yeah, Wednesday night. Yeah, Wednesday night. We'll be, it's <laughs> super late. It's kind of last minute thing for me, so I'm just happy to be out here. But uh, yeah, we're uh, we're actually going. We're just now stopping, and charging up at the supercharger for this Tesla, and uh, we have the races here pretty soon. Five hours later. All right, so we finally made it out here. It's obviously the next morning, so we got here about five o'clock in the morning, and I'm dead. Um, we're just getting out of here now. It's like eleven o'clock. And uh, we're heading over to Tesla to get out to the track. We use our media passes and get behind the lines. Uh, I'm trying to slug down this coffee. The lady at the office said that it was fresh brewed. That was a lie. But I mean, we're soldiering on. We'll be at the track here just a minute. All right, so we finally just made it out of here. Day one, this is roll racing. Um, we're gonna go around and kind of check everything out, get a good look, and uh, I mean, there's some McLaren's right over there. There's really everything exotic out here you can possibly get. We're not racing the plan, though, sadly. But we're about to get into it. We're gonna go. Uh, we're gonna go see if we can find some of the big name people to clean this. Cooper. Uh, check out some of these big shops that are out here and uh, take a look at what they got, and we'll get into the roll racing. start roll racing out here We've got all the exotics this is uh it's lane one a lot of these cars you guys have seen several other videos one of the more notable ones i've seen everywhere is this little integra right over here i've seen this guy all over 1320s videos just beating the hell out of everybody it's it's not the normal thing you see out here so i mean you got all these exotics and then you got a Honda that's really, suit up, please, in the lane. Drivers, really, really is out here keeping please. up with everybody. I think he's actually won quite a few of these. Two, I'll see if I can talk lane. with him a little bit later. Wagon motor. Awesome. What kind of power you make? I don't know if you keep your number secret or not. No, no, we just I kind of set it up low at about 750 and just been kind of playing with it here. Um, we lost fifth gear already, <laughs> stuff like that. So we're kind of kind of just playing with what we can. We're just happy to have made it here to do something. Absolutely, absolutely. But uh, yeah. 
what does this thing weigh? Uh, before we put the gauge in it, it was about 2,400. So we're oh. hoping to stick around. <laughs> yeah, that 750. 20. I mean, you're you're probably golden to keep up with these heavy guys out here. Hopefully, we can add some more sauce to it to keep up a little better. So you got a little bit more room to, yeah. to let it be. I got it's just what it's gonna hold over here. But. Awesome, man. Well, it was really good to meet you guys. Uh, yeah. We'll get a lot of video Thank for you. you. changes lately or not but uh just kind of give me your goal what are you looking for today i know you hopefully turned it up a little bit for texas 2k um not yet we're gonna hope to go out there and make a nice a to b qualifying hit if it can go like it anywhere from an 80 to a 780 i'll be happy and that should be the tune-up that it has in there depending on how long i'm in the loud pedal i can usually control where it kind of falls in that zone but try to just get a nice a to b hit get on the board and then maybe we can throw some more at it if we're feeling feeling a little froggy. You got Alpha's out here, right? Yep, he's here. Okay, so you have the ability if you want to, you can. Yeah, we can. We can crank it in the moon. We yeah. got some more left on the table. Yeah. You're, you're not playing it safe for anything coming up, are you? Nope. This is. This is. Um, if this is where the engine dies, this is where it dies. Awesome, man. That's that's awesome to hear. I mean, that's just kind of the way it is with Texas yeah, 2K. Yeah, you leave it all out there. Yeah, exactly. exactly, exactly. You're bringing it home running. I didn't bring it home running last year. I don't. Probably won't bring it home running this year. Uh, what's your personal best again? It's been an 80. Yep. 780 and a pretty good DA, but again, we haven't really thrown that much at it. Like, it's got a lot at it, but not a lot. Yeah, thank you. Uh, awesome, man. I'm really happy you guys came out. Happy you were able to make it. I'm a big fan of the Mustang, too. I'm, a, I'm an LSA guy. They're so, so great. Yeah. That's... Such a simple, fun combination. Yeah. This thing's been so good to me. The guys over at Induction Performance, just they have such a good platform and program with this engine that basically I'm just the uh, kind of the monkey behind the chassis kind of yeah. It, it feels good to be that guy. Sometimes the this stuff works out, oh, yeah, it feels good great, to be that you know? guy. Their, their setup works great. It's usually me that's doing something that's uh, <laughs> making it not work as great. Yeah. Awesome, man. Well, hey, it's really good to see you. We're going to be rooting for you. I see Brondi back there. Hey, how you doing? Good, good. Awesome, man. We'll be rooting for you. Uh, we'll, we'll get all the videos we can. But for sure, appreciate yeah, it, brother. Appreciate it. All right, thanks, thanks guys. guys.
you made it. Dude, awesome fire. job, man. Oh, awesome man, job. I love seeing all these people cleared out, sitting here in the lanes. Right. It's, <laughs> today's been a whole lot nicer. Yeah, as, the, as, the, as the last man standing. Everybody packed up, you know, driving home. Here we are. <laughs> oh, yeah. We were those so, people last year. Oh, yeah. Have you seen this truck run? I haven't seen him run yet. I have um, no he, idea what he He runs. raced my buddy, and I just looked at his last pass, and he went 791. So, so we're well we're within even. your reach. I just went 794. Yeah. Dude, this is going to be 797. So yeah, it's, yeah. it's going to be tight. So he's breaking it up. I don't know. Because the breakout is 7879. Oh, I forget about the breakout. Yeah. So you've got a. Uh, they're making it going to be a close race. Yeah. That's awesome. That's going to be sweet, dude. Yeah, that's going to be really I got a little nice. more in the tank, though. Yeah. Let's well, be yeah, 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 yeah. You guys, we can always just hit that through. Well, they have a breakout at 780. So yeah. that's oh, that's a big equalizer yeah, right there. Yeah, but here's the thing: is that if he's if he gets out on him enough, he just right. That's what I've done every yeah, time. I've been off. slow. Every yeah. pass has been 150 miles an hour. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, like at your best, what are you in like the 170s? It's been an yeah. 80. Yeah. 80. Yeah. yeah. So it's been 80 a handful of times. The motor's definitely down a little bit. You know, it's it's two seasons on this thing, yeah. and it's 180 cubic inch that we are just beating the life out of. <laughs> we literally we don't treat this engine nicely at all. <laughs> And it takes it in strides. Did you get out of the hole in the last pass? Yeah, yeah, I, I was out on him on the 60 foot. I treat him, so it, was, it felt good. Yeah, we, we missed it. The last pass I saw was your uh, your qualifying where you power wheelied all the way down the track. Yeah, yeah, because I was, I was recording and I was like, <laughs> yeah, it was a, out and I was like, all right, yeah. I'm going to run back over and I'm like, hauling ass. They do that in California, I heard. <laughs> yeah, right. One of these. <laughs> <laughs> Two wide thrown out. Yeah. <laughs> awesome, man. Well, we're going to be rooting for you. Hey, thanks, guys. A few moments later. Oh, missed it by almost nothing. Jasmine, what year uh, Skyline do you have? I have a 2015 GTR R35. R35? Yes, and sir. And what class are you going to be running in? I'm going to be doing DCT class, the drag racing, tomorrow. Okay, yeah. so she's doing, so let me get this straight. As you can see, she's holding a beverage right now. We had just had this conversation. So <laughs> she's not doing any racing today, but she's on Don't beverage worry, beverage one. And we might come back and do beverage two, three, four later on. Cause we're all, we're Maybe part. 20, we'll yeah, well, 20, <laughs> holy shit. Oh, shit. Okay, she, no, she ain't no, a lightweight, no. she ain't no lightweight. So yeah. what year is it? 2015. Okay. It's a little dirty. We had a long road trip. Yeah. Um, just full bolt on the 85. Um, Making about 650 for wheels, nothing too crazy. Okay, so um, just so you know, in, in GTR terms, it makes 800. Okay, just oh, so you know. Whoa. I mean... <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, yeah. it doesn't. <laughs> what happens at Texas 2K stays at Texas 2K. <laughs> okay, I got you. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and then, uh, who, so your, your boy, is it your boyfriend or husband? Husband. Husband, okay. Yes. Now, and they, you guys just recently moved here from New York to that's Dallas. Correct. Okay. Yes. So you're gonna see this car around pretty good. They've already got their plates, their Texas plates, and all that stuff. And her husband's in the back right here. He just he doesn't not that he doesn't want to be on camera, but he's like, hey man, she she's she's the boss, so we're gonna let her take care of it. I don't want to I don't touch other people's cars. Can you go ahead and pop it up before me? Let's get a looky. So it's just stock. Uh, nothing crazy, like I said, just bolt-ons. We want to try and get into the nines before we do any turbos. Yeah. That is the goal. Okay. Right now we are at a 10 -0 flat. Oh yeah. So we're there almost. Yeah. We just Super do some close. Fine and you tomorrow and uh, good luck. Thank we you. hope that you guys get your nine nine or better. Yes. Thank you very much. All right. No problem.
the next day. Okay, let's do it. All right, we got Jasmine coming up in the GTR, going for a personal best, 9-9. Nine, nine. She's staging up right here. What do you got going on with this motor? Anything special? Sure. So the car is built by Cosmic Motorsports here in Houston. It's got their race short block put in together by uh, P2P along with their race heads and uh, well, P2P as well. Uh, 7685 Gen 2. The turbo kit was custom built by Ranch, uh, Ranch Bill in uh, Liberty Lake, Washington, if I believe. Phenomenal work by them. So is the intercooler piping, everything else like that. But Cosmic is really the ones that like went through this car tooth and nail and just fixed all those little gremlins that were hiding. Um, they've done a phenomenal job for me. We're really, really, really excited. Like this is the first time the car, second time the car's competed at Texas 2K. You know, last year everybody knows famously like we blew up the drive shaft and the dip. People can, you know, were messing us about it, how funny it was. Um, but you know, first time car comes out and it's it's really been a long history for her. She goes out and does a 9.2 on 32 pounds of boost with this size turbo. So she's got plenty, plenty more in it. Um, and all the driving credit goes to Onyx of Cosmic. Everybody always asks me to drive the car myself, but I, I try explaining to everyone. It's, it's not that I'm afraid of it. I just wanted to do justice by the car. It's been such a long road that I know that I'm going to get in it, get nervous and possibly harm something. So I'd rather take the time in the off season, learn the car and go little by little. But you know, yeah. at a, this level at Texas 2K, I'd rather have a yeah, professional. Texas like, 2K is not the place right. to come it's out not and the learn. Time to, you yeah, know, yeah, try yeah. to learn the car at Texas 2K yeah. and break something, or you know, she she deserves better than than me right now. And I'll eventually get there, but you know, Onyx is the pro. It's that possibility of maybe even winning Texas 2K versus trying to break a record. Obviously, you know, yeah. winning the class would be yeah, it's a tough class. Smarter, it's right? a tough class, and it's a tough class. There's a lot of big time competition, some amazing cars, amazing racers. So it's I'm proud just to even be a part of it let alone into the second round of elimination well awesome man we're uh, we're definitely going to be rooting for you we'll get all the that. video we can for you out there and uh, uh we'll let you know but um man thank you so much for, for no, having thank us thank you guys for having us i really really appreciate it The shoe! The shoe! So we just got notified that Omar is getting a buy run this pass. Um, 
the Corvette he was supposed to race, the ZR1 he was supposed to race, just broke. So he is going to get a fly run, and I think he's just going to break the beams and uh, roll on from there. Perfect, here we go, on to the finals. Ready to send it, dude? I'm so excited! Ready to send it. He's gonna send it! I wanna bomb it, I'm so excited. You ready, buddy? All right, all right, do your thing. You did it, baby! Yeah, you you did it! Stuff. Good stuff, really man. Tough, Good man. stuff. All right, guys, that is officially a wrap for TX2K22. We just got a little bit of sleep. It is 5.30 in the morning. We're heading back to DFW now, so. Start editing and all this stuff and get it ready for you guys. It's a long trip back. We got to stop at a couple of superchargers. But I mean, couldn't have been more fun than the plaid though. It's not often you get to bring a phone crew out and race and have all the junk in the back. All right, well, it's been a great one, guys. On to the next.